Tesla Q1 2021 production and delivery predictions. I'm Brian. Welcome to my Tesla weekend. I'm going to do a quick and dirty one so we can get this out in time. What I've done, for the most part, is use uh, 2020s figures from Q4 and adjust them accordingly. Uh, in terms of expectations, the fact set consensus is coming in at 172,000 units, and I've seen fact sets lower than this, but I'm using the figure uh, that was published by Rob Maurer over on Tesla Daily. He does a fantastic work, and his model is a far more in-depth than mine, if a little less aggressive. So let's uh, jump right into it. Fremont's daily uh, run rate in Q4 as I see it, was 1,050 units per day. And let's go ahead and change this to Blick. Uh, and I believe we can do a 3% uh, efficiency improvement. We can increase the run rate per day, 1,082, extra 30 units a day. Total days in the quarter, 90. So, uh, yeah, it's a shorter quarter than last time. And there was some downtime between chip shortages and uh, the fire outside at the Gigapress. I don't know how much any of that slowed anything down. I think six days is more than enough to provide. So that means 1,082 times 84 days. I'm seeing Fremont 90,896. Let's go ahead and bump this guy in here. Oh, three and Y. Where am I at? Here we go. Now, uh, on the SNX, fact set saying 12,000, I just don't see how that's the case because we've seen so painfully few of them on the road. I think I've got the lowest estimate out there, and this is based on wild ass guess 2,000. I see 2,000 units being what is out there. And uh, some of these, by the way, aren't broken down because they aren't broken down in the data available. So, fact set 172,000, Tesla's consensus 170, almost four. Uh, which is, you know, great. So, what else is important? Let's look at Shanghai's Model 3 daily run rate in Q4. 729. In my head, it was higher than that. I don't know why. But all right, here we are. Efficiency improvement of 5% gives us 765 units a day. And I don't think that's crazy. Total days in the quarter, again, 90. And seven days of downtime is what I'm estimating uh, because there's a two-week um, uh, Chinese New Year. Uh, but they weren't actually down for that time. They were just uh, running at a reduced capacity. So I think half is fine, giving us Model 3 estimate 63,502. Now, <laughs> Shanghai Model Y last quarter sold none. Sold none. Produced none, sold none. Delivered none anyway. Market consensus, we don't have a number. Uh, so I'm just saying 1,500 per week. I think that's very reasonable. And that takes us to a, a, a My Tesla Weekend estimate of 174, 156 produced. Now I'm not sure in terms of deliveries, uh, I think that's the production numbers. I think deliveries would actually be maybe a little higher than this because uh, they were clearing out the models S and X and not producing very many. Uh, but I'm going to just use this number for both. I'm going to say it's 174, 156 for both. I am higher than the fact tech consensus and the market consensus, and really kind of higher than everyone, except the legendary Gojo, the busted nut himself. Uh, he's a kook, and he's a liar, and uh, he's saying 188,000 units, which I can only assume he got to by dividing the 750,000 annual target by four which is, you know, completely dishonest and assumes zero ramp for the year. So this number, the actual real number, which we'll come back to when it comes out. So expect a second one of these this weekend, comparing how I did. What's your guess? Leave it in the comments. Um, I think what we might want to do is, uh, yeah, I want to see who gets the closest in the comments. I want to see who gets the closest. So leave a comment, leave two, leave 10. I don't know. But, you know, switch accounts if you got us so that so that if uh, something comes of it, you get your credit. I don't know, man. What do you think? Anyway, uh, 
that's it. Uh, stay tuned. Stay juicy. Let me know what I missed in the comments. I'm sure I've missed something. Give me an earload and uh, can't wait to hear from you clever robots all upon that flippity flop. And by the way, my apologies for not doing an April Fool's joke. I had a bunch in mind. I just ran out of time making actual content I thought you guys would actually want. So, my apologies.